If I need to fool all the magicians in the room, I perform the knowing. Lay people, needless to say, do not stand a chance. What I really love about this trick is the level of impossibility. Magicians especially can see that there should be no way to find the card. Even if the cards were face up, it would be hard to imagine how you could find the card. And yet in this trick, the cards are always face down. How can you find that card? Let me show you the famous 21 card trick. The first step is to give the deck a shuffle. The second step is to get 21 cards. There's three, there's two and two, that's seven. Three and two and two, seven more. Three and two and two, that is 21 cards. Let's give these a bit of a shuffle and get down to business. Okay, spectator is handed the packet and told to do the standard deal, three cards in a row, and then continue the threes until they've dealt the entire packet out. Cards have been shuffled, nobody knows where any card is at this point. The spectator then picks up any pile, and you can do this with your back turned if you want. Your back is turned, spectator picks up any pile. I'll just take this one, and they shuffle the packet. Spectator looks at the top card. If they don't like it, they can reshuffle and go with a different card. They leave it on top. Now you tell the spectator, cut any number of cards from either pile and drop them on top of your card. Not all cards. In other words, don't pick up the entire pile. Pick up some cards, drop them on top, and now bury the entire packet in the middle of the unused pile. This. This is where it becomes really hard to imagine how that card could be found under any circumstances. And then finally, shuffle up whatever's left over, put them on top. The magician turns around and says, and now, the famous 21 card trick. I want you to imagine your card is out there somewhere, and I want you to try to figure out which column your card falls in. So here we go, I'm gonna deal them out. And go ahead and take, oh wait a minute. Is this your card? Spectator says yes, you just go, we're done. And it just kind of gets there really fast. It's a really great trick, a really fun trick to perform. Uh, you got the full instructions in the download. And the fact that the cards are face down all the time until you deal one card face up doubles the impossibility level. I hope you guys will use this and fool the crap out of as many people as possible.